Hello! Alright, we are starting this. This is my Antonic at the Olympics. For the Olympics that never happened. But we're going to enjoy this anyway. So drinking a bit of tea. This is continuing my vacation series that I have started, which Obviously, we're going to Tokyo. But, yeah. Should be fun. I haven't played yet. Probably go back to go vacation. But today is Olympics. So let's get started. We are playing for the US. Choose how you want to play on this screen. Well, we're doing story mode, I think. That seems like a good place to start. So, set in present and past Tokyo. Okay. Chapter 1, A Mysterious Game System. <laughs> it's finally time for the Olympic Games in Tokyo. I can't wait for the intense matches. Yeah. Mario, Sonic! I've been licking all over for you two. <laughs> A gift arrived addressed to both of you, so I'm here to deliver it. I wonder what could be inside. Mario and Sonic with love in commemoration of the Olympic Games in Tokyo. We made a little game to t let you experience the past Olympic Games in Tokyo. By all means, give it a try. So it says, what's the deal with this? Who sent it? An odd looking device. It looks like a rather retro game system. It says Tokyo 64 on it. Is that the name of the game? Who do you think sent it? There's no name on here. Whoever it wants us whoever it is wants us to play, huh? I smell something fishy. We should be careful, Mario. Why are they just standing there chatting? Turn it on already. Maybe they don't know where the on switch is. I uh, couldn't find them myself at first. They nitpicking my brain design. There's actually no issue with the location of the power switch. None. Hey, check it out. Luigi turned up too. Sorry, I cannot do their voices. <laughs> Luigi, have you ever seen a game system like this before? 
If you ask me, this thing looks 100% shady and 100% like it's from a certain you know who. Oh. No. Oh, come on. Hurry it up already. Are they ever gonna press that stupid switch? Is this plan really gonna work? I'm not letting you off the hook if it doesn't. Settle down. They should hit the switch any moment now. Can't take it anymore. I'll give him a little surprise and make him turn it on. Hey, don't be hasty. You'll lay my brilliant plans to absolute waste. Stop, I tell you. You too. Oh, the switch! What? Are you going back to the past? Are everyone else sent back to the past? <laughs> Dr. Eggman and Bowser's Scheme. Nineteen sixty four. All right, so we did go back to the past. Mario, Sonic, what's going on with that new er old look? Whoa, why do I look like this? It ain't just you chumps. Eggman, what's the story? What? You still don't get it? Take a look around. This place is serious retro vibe. It's like the old video game land. Oh, no way! We're... Oh, very much yes way! Whoever the light touches gets swallowed up into the game. No, I was only supposed to get Mario and Sonic, but now we're here too? Hey, what gives? Eggman, hurry up and explain already. Oh. He said something about how it was only supposed to get you two. Hey, we don't need your input here. Oh, I see. I think I get what's going on. Your plan was to drag us into the game and trap us here, huh? The secret's out, then fine. Yes, that present was indeed from me and Bowser. To be more precise, I designed the game system and Magic Koopa's magic made it so it could swallow you two up. Gwahaha, and now you're trapped here. Well, we're trapped here too. If only we didn't get hit by that light. That just means we'll get the magic Koopa to do a little hocus pocus and we'll be out of here in no time, yeah? Only with that simple, we don't know where magic Koopa is and Luigi is carrying the system around. Sheesh. Okay then, plan B. I mean, you built the thing. You must have set up some way to get home, right? Unfortunately, once you're in, you're in for good. There's no returning to the outside world. Not ever. No, it can't be. No, this game thing is defective. This cockamamie plan of yours is a total mess. Silence, in case you've forgotten you had an equal part in concocting this scheme. Hmm, 
gonna say, wasn't this game called Tokyo 64? Wait, does that mean the 1964 Olympic Games are being held here now? Bowser, a moment if you would. Why don't we compete in these games? What? At a time like this? I've got an idea, you see. Why not give the competition a try? Just trust me. Besides, we've got plenty of time to spare. Wouldn't it be nice to experience a piece of history like this? I don't really get it, but if you want to do it that badly, I guess we could give it a shot. If we compete, we'll bring home the gold for sure. Why would Eggman want to compete in the Olympic Games at a time like this? He's got to be up to no good. That's for sure. Let's go compete in the Olympic Games too and find out what they're up to. Alright Mario, if you're wondering about anything, just ask. Sure, that's also a symbol. There are many Olympic emblems and they're all different. That's because each Olympic Games gets a new one. Which were the first to have one? Um, I don't know. The 8th Olympic Games. Ever since then, each Olympic Games created its very own emblem. Alright. This one. Asia is the biggest continent. It's almost a third of all the land in the world. How many times did the Olympic Games happen in Asia before they were held in Tokyo in 1964? Aisha Tur! I guess we're doing trivia. I do not know the answers because I do not know the Olympics that well. Well, so, let's just view the answer because I have no idea. I could guess. Like, I, I don't know. We'll say five? Zero. Okay. <laughs> See, that's how much I know. <laughs> Tokyo 1964 was the very first Olympic Games to be held in Asia. That's why so many people around the world were very excited about it. Okay. Cool. How are you today? Alright, uh... Bark! Bark! He says that if you enter here, the vast expanse of the venue comes into view. It's a sight to see. Have you competed in any events at the National Stadium? You should try it before moving on to another venue. The same. Doing alright, had a bit of a late night, but we're doing good. Oh, that's good. I was very tired this morning, I went back to sleep. <laughs> but I seem to be alright now. So, here I am. This is the entrance. It's a big place, so try not to get lost. The opening ceremony was held here. It was fantastically festive, with athletes gathered from all around the world. Hold it. The venue isn't that way. Okay, fine. We'll, we'll just go the right way. <laughs> this is the heart. Okay, that is not purple. That's more pink. It looks pink to me. I'm not sure why it says purple. But okay. 
This is the heart of the Tokyo Olympic Games. The stadium size is sort of overwhelming. This game seems rather different from other Olympic games. Yes, it is pink. Hi Mario, they say you can get useful info just by walking around all over the place. Squeak, squeak. Pocky says he's a big fan of track and field events and he gets to see them live here. Tokyo Olympic Games have finally started. I wish they'd never end. It is rather different. <laughs> this national stadium is a central venue of the Olympic Games Tokyo 1964. Okay, lots of cities are very proud of their big famous sports centers. For Tokyo, this is the national stadium. What year was it built? had to have been built for the Olympics, I assume. So let's just say 1960, maybe, if it can be built in four years. 58, close. If you're wondering why it was built so far ahead of night of Tokyo 64, that's because it was originally built for the third Asian game, so... Alright. Well, that was two years off. Alright, here we go. What are you doing here? The spectator seats are over there. Go ahead, get going! We're competing too. Let me see. The event that's about to start is the 100 meter. The perfect event for little me. What? Why are you trying to get involved? I don't have time for your nonsense. Go take in the sights of 60s Tokyo or something. Guahaha. Relax, Doc. This is the perfect opportunity to show him who's boss. Ah, fine. Just don't get in my way. Alright, Mario, if you're wondering about anything, just ask. Defeat Dr. Eggman! We can totally do that. As the event begins, hold A to charge power, release at start to start running. Uh, press A repeatedly to go faster. Alright, got that. Alright. Start. Coming. And they're off. I totally Coming. defeat him. Look at me go. That record beat the last one. I mean, okay, Sonic totally cheated. <laughs> I mean, come on! There's no way Eggman would beat Sonic. Well, yes, because we went back in time to 1964, so... That's why we're these old sprites. <laughs> Except the fact that in 1964, none of these characters actually existed. Well, maybe Mario did. But I think he was after. Anyway. This is unbelievable. How could I use- how could I lose? No, they didn't exist because I think, you know, these characters started in late 70s. And Mario wasn't Mario then anyway. So, and Sonic wasn't till later. So, yeah, none of these characters existed. <laughs> Piece of cake! That was too easy. You ought to do some more training, Eggman. Oh, 
I've only started to get warmed up, and the next games have just begun. The next event will be ours. Yeah, so he was originally Jumpman, but that was like the 70s, I think. Or early 80s. The we'll search oh. for Tales. Hi, Luigi. You seem worried. Did something happen? Hey. Mario and Sonic got sucked into that game system. The impossible has happened. Oh. That thing is really cute. Right. Omo Chow. That's cute. I haven't really played Sonic games, but... Yeah. That's cute. Okay, I believe you, but I still don't know how I can help. I mean, the only Sonic games I've actually played are the original ones. I didn't play past those. <laughs> I still have to try Sonic Mania, but anyway. Someone who's good with machines, what does... Does this have something to do with what you were just saying? Hey. All right. If it's got to do with machines, Tails is your guy. I love Tails. Tails is adorable. I don't know where he is. I haven't seen him around here, so maybe try looking for him at one of the other venues. Hello there. And it's Amy. Hey there, what brings you here, Luigi? Oh, are you thinking of competing? What a coincidence. I was about to do the same. All right. You have it all wrong. Luigi is looking for tails. Hey. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? I know where he is. Ow. You do? Where is he? <laughs> First, how about you join the event with me? It'll be fine. You'll find Tails in no time. I've entered in the 100M, but there aren't enough competitors, so you haven't been able to start. I'll help you find Tails afterward, so come on, pretty please. Hey. <laughs> Alright, then let's go, and don't think of slacking off. You got that? Tokyo 64 acquired. Alright, let's do it. Buttons only, because I'm using a pro controller. I don't feel like doing motion control. Hold R to charge power. Okay, so it's a little different. That's the same. And press R to use super dash. Alright. Well, let's do this. On your marks. Come on, Luigi. No, I failed. <laughs> Okay, let's let's try that again. <laughs> Poor Luigi. On your marks. Still second. Maybe I need to do it sooner. Start charging 
Instant ready disappears. Okay, so maybe I should wait. I was a little off. I didn't wait for ready to disappear. That's my problem. I was closer that time though. Getting close. Maybe I need to still hold the button. Because I, I lost the ability to supercharge. That was a fail. I'm going to get this right. Accelerate slightly by repeatedly pressing. Okay. Press your chest out after super dash. That's what I did. Maybe I just need to keep holding it down. I'll try. Quite work. But oh 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 what's this? Oh no I almost had it, but I had to keep holding it down. Why do I do these things? That was very close. Got this, Luigi. You got this, Luigi. Yes. Oh, that was so close. Look at that. But we did it. It only took us multiple tries. Look at that score. <laughs> it almost wasn't a win, but we did it. Go Luigi. You're speedier than I thought, Luigi. Huh? Alright, oh, you were looking for Tails. He was here a, wh a little while ago, but he said he wanted to watch karate. The karate venue is close by here. Well, we should be able to find him fast then. And as promised, I'll come help you out. Let's go. Amy has joined. You can view the characters that have joined you in the menu. To do so, select View Companions. Alright. 
karate is being held nearby. Alright, he already said that. Mm -hmm. As promised, I'll come help you out. Let's go. Right. Tokyo 2020 Olympic mascot is called Mirei Toa. Okay. The opening ceremony at the Olympic Stadium was awesome. I didn't have a ticket, so I watched on TV. It's a great honor for a city to be chosen to host. That's why it's so rare for a city to host multiple times. There are only a few cities that have done it. Do you know how many? I want to say two. Five. I am just completely wrong. Out of those five, the only one located in Asia is Tokyo. That makes Tokyo 2020 pretty special, don't you think? Well, considering it never happened. But it's supposed to happen this summer. We'll see. Um, yeah, that does make it pretty special. This is an interesting game in the context of history. Just cause of what happened. <laughs> There's a rule that if someone breaks a, re a world record, it doesn't count if there's too much wind speed. What's the fastest wind speed for a record to count? Um... Oh gosh, I don't even know what to guess. Can I say... 22 meters per second. Okay, I don't know, because, like, wind speed. I'm not... I'm bad at this trivia. <laughs> I think we, we know that by now. If the wind is going at this speed or slower, the record can most world records have been set with at least some help from the wind. Okay. What is Amy's most interesting hobby? Um. Again, I haven't played much Sonic. I think she likes to take care of Chow, which if I, if I recall. Um, does she read? I don't know. She's really cute, but I don't know her hobbies. <laughs> Fortune telling. Okay, I would have never guessed that. Amy enjoys many kinds of fortune telling. She has other hobbies too, like shopping and cooking. Alright, let's go this way. Hello, oh, Luigi. It seems like there's plenty to discover if you take a walk. <laughs> you can check out karate at the Nippon Budokan. Okay. We'll find our way there. There's another trivia. Mario and Luigi's mustaches are shaped differently. What does Luigi's look like? That's not something I ever thought about. <laughs> um. Well. It looks like a bow tie? <laughs> I don't know. A pair of swooshes. Okay. I guess that works. I guess that's how you could describe his mustache. <laughs> so the Olympic Games are even more exciting because they're only held every four years. Except for when they're held in five. 
Um, they used so much wood building the Olympic Stadium. It smells like I'm in the woods. That's pleasant. Yes! The Olympic Stadium sure is big. They hold track and field events here. It's built on the same site as the old National Stadium. The new stadium roof is made with the material collected from each prefecture of Japan. What is this material? I want to say steel. It's wood. Right, because you just said it. it smells like wood. But the picture... Sorry. Ah, uh, the wooden larch, cedar beams, and joists on the roof are sourced from all 47 prefectures of Japan. Together, they symbolize the nation's unity. That's really nice. Just told me it smelled like a forest. Yeah. Let's just not talk about it. <laughs> Did I talk to you? Thanks for your patience. This area is open again. Okay. There you go. Go to the map. Bits of trivia is pretty interesting. I'm just terrible at it. <laughs> but that's alright. It's just for fun. Now go to Metropolitan Gymnasium, the Budokan, and Tokyo Station. And travel to various locations as you progress through the story and more will become available. Alright, let's go where we need to go. Here. Find Tails. In the Tokyo 1964 games, the judo competition was held at the Nippon Budokan. I was looking forward to seeing a ninja in Japan, but I haven't found one. They must be really good at hiding. Okay, anyone else to talk to before I... Karate is a new event added for the Tokyo 2020 Games. It's not just sporting events that are held here. Lots of music and concerts are performed here too. Yes! wonder if they'll have the Koku Kokujikan? I don't know. I don't know what that building is. Um, hello there, Luigi. The karate event is being held here. Have you come to watch the bouts, or have you come to enter as a competitor, perhaps? Oh, you're searching for Tails. Oh, well, that's too bad. Tails finished watching and left to go somewhere else. He said something about a promise to keep. A promise? With who, I wonder? Well, I can't believe he's be go he'd go off somewhere else in such a hurry. If he'd come a little sooner, you might have caught him. I think he was headed over to the venues in the Ariaki area with Princess Daisy. Oh, Daisy's with him too? Well, thanks for the info. Let's hurry up and head to Ariaki. We might be able to catch up with them. Okay. I hope I said that right. It's another very large sports arena in Tokyo. I've never been to Tokyo. I would love to. Or anywhere in Japan, really. It looked like Tails was heading towards Ariaki with Princess Daisy. Okay, so that's just repeating. These ones are probably repeating too. Yep. So let's go. Hey, 
Hey, Spushy! Team Luigi. Well, we're playing the story mode. So, I'll just play whoever I end up being. Okay, so Tokyo Tower and Kabuzika? Is that what that said? Ariaki, that's where you need to go. Now go to Tokyo Tower, Shibuya, Scramble, Crossing, Kabuzi, Kabukiza, sorry, Theater, and Ariaki, Urban Sports and Gymnastics. Okay. Well, said that they were here with, right, there's the picture. So let's go here. Why is Tails hanging out with Daisy? I have no idea. This is the Ariaki Gymnastics Center. The Ariaki Urban Sports Park is right next door. See, that's a proper purple. In 1964, the purple toad definitely looks pink. And even this purple toad still looks pinkish, but it's kind of in that range, so I'll give it to. Give it to the toad that he's purple. <laughs> Princess Daisy, she's warming up for the event. Alright. Ariaki Gymnastics Center is an indoor facility so you can spectate in cool comfort. Okay, so this center was built for the Tokyo 2020 Olympics, but where it stands there used to be another facility, one that was not related to sports at all. What was it? Um, let's just say it was a theater, because I have no idea. Or an office building. A lumber yard! Okay, see, I'm totally off. <laughs> Did you know that long ago lumber was commonly transported using waterways? Okay. I came to watch gymnastics. I like jumping around, but I can't hold a candle to the athletes. Toad. Okay, I'll give it to you that in some games you jump, but in some games you don't. It was decided in 2012. 13 that the Olympic Games would be held in Tokyo in 2020. Wait, it was decided back then? Seven years ago? Gosh, I don't remember, but okay. And there's Daisy. Let's see if there's anyone else. Nope. Alright. Luigi and Amy too? Did you come to cheer me on? I'm so glad. I'm about to compete in the floor exercise event. I just came to watch, but the more I, wa I watched, the more I wanted to try it. So I just decided to go for it. I'm warming up now. Hey, I like this event too. Which means we're gonna play Amy. Why don't you compete against me then? And then Luigi can be the judge of which of us is the champ. Oh, that'd be a hard choice for Luigi. Huh? Tails? Whoa, we were headed there, but we split up. He said he was meeting someone at another venue, so I ended up coming here by myself. Alright, I got carried away and totally forgot we were looking for him. Would you mind if we stayed here a bit so I can compete with Daisy? I really want to take her up on our invitation and try this event. 
Yay, I'm so happy. If you're going to compete, that makes me want to do it even more. Do you mind, Luigi? Can you spend a little time here? I'm not going to lose. Hey. No slouch either, you know. I'll show you some of my awesome skills, Luigi. Oh, Sposhi, did I forget to ask? Uh, how are you? Better not be a hard decision for Luigi, because if you better not... Because if he picks... Um, me, Luigi is dead meat. Okay. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's do this. During each run up, press A repeatedly to run- wait. Why is it showing Luigi? I thought we were gonna play Amy. Maybe that's just for the picture. Anyway. Press A repeatedly to run faster and earn more time to perform your routine. Yes. I know. That, that's why it's funny. Enter the commands that appear on screen to perform your routine. The quicker you perform the correct moves, the better your score. During a bounce move, tilt in the direction shown. Alright. Tilt down to land time with the blue landing ring for a better rating. During your cartwheel to routine, enter command shown. Okay. We can do it. Oh, cool. Alright, I'll listen to your st stories of that later today. Alright, so, let's do this. We are Amy. We can do it. Ah. Uh, uh, I hit the wrong button. <laughs> Never mind. That was terrible. And I wasn't... Okay. We're gonna have to try this again. <laughs> Because I'm not getting anything. This is harder than it seems. Okay. That was awful. <laughs> Let's do that again. I think I was just distracted. Ah, shoot. No, we're, we're not gonna do that. Let's try again. Start over. Pay attention this time. There we go. Much better. Well, that was Still, though. I can make up for it. still one. No. It goes so fast. Uh -huh. Oh, 
Oh shoot. Why did it get on the cartwheel? Alright. So, we'll try that again. We were close. Third time's a charm. I still got points. I'm too slow for that. But I still beat her. It's okay. We won. It's fine. I don't have to be great. I just have to be better. I'm using a strength or balancing move that needs posture adjustment. Beware of momentum. Stop your input just before you overlap. Oh, you're not supposed to overlap. Okay. Fine. Whatever. On to the next one. Woohoo! No, I lost. But you were amazing, Daisy. That match was great. It hardly even matters which one of us won or lost. Oh, oh really? What did you think, Luigi? Oh, oh sorry. Right, Tails. I got totally wrapped up in the competition. Oh. We just split up, so he should still be nearby. Why are you looking for him in the first place, though? That's right, I didn't ask that either. What's up? No way, really? I can't believe it. Sonic and Mario got sucked into this thing? Unbelievable. Yep, and they are stuck in 1964. And then you've been looking for Tails since he's good with machines? What a pickle. I had no idea it was something so urgent. I'll come along and help you find him too. Let's go check out the venues nearby. First let's head to a nearby arena. Gotta hurry and find tails. All right, let's do that. Okay, so yeah, once you talk to them once, they don't say anything new. So he's down here. Or, no, he's here. There he is. Let's talk to these guys first. <laughs> this is the Ariaki Urban Sports Park. Some people sometimes confuse it with the Omi the Urban Sports Park. So be careful. Have you ever ridden a skateboard? It might look easy, but it's actually quite a challenge. I actually did. Once upon a time. 
I never got the hang of it though. It was way back when I was very, very little. I was like six or seven. But anyway, the Ariaki Urban Sports Park is really close to the Olympic Village. It's very convenient. I had a friend and he tried to teach me because he loved to skateboard. And I just never got the hang of it. Are you all planning to compete or are you here to spectate? I'm here to watch the skateboarding event. Skaters of the world rejoice. Skateboarding will be at the Olympic Games taking place at Urban Sports Park. How many sp skating events will there be? Three is a good number, so let's go with that. Four. Close. The four events are park and street, men and women, or both. Park events will be in a complex mega bowl, while street events will be in a city-like setting. Okay. Cool. I've always wanted to learn how to skate, but fully now scares me too much to try. Yeah, I was kind of scared. But... It didn't end up sticking anyway. <laughs> Hi there, Luigi. Are you into skateboarding too? I thought it looked pretty cool, so I promised Sonic I'd enter the event with him. But he's running late and it's just about to start. I wonder what's up. The skateboarding event is about to begin. All, right. All competitors should gather here. If you're late, you'll be disqualified. Can't wait for Sonic any longer. Luigi, could you take his place and join me? Tails right. is the cutest. He's not fun as a character to play. But I always adored his look. Come now, hurry to the meeting point. Not fun as a character to play in the original games that I did play. I mean. Because I don't know past that. Pull off as many tricks as you can within the time limit to rack up your score. Skater with the most pin points wins. Tilt to turn. Press A to jump. If you ride into bank at an angle, you can grind or slide. Okay. When super gauge is full, hold R and press A on a ramp. Think we're slow to do a super trick. Alright. Let's try it. Hopefully you won't fail. Oh, we already have a score to beat. Doesn't seem too hard. So. Oh. Lots of time though. Yeah, 
actually get up. No. Okay, there we go. Look at that balance. Alright, simple. <laughs> I didn't get any perfect jumps, but hey. No problems. I'll take it. Press A right when landing for a burst of speed. That's what I didn't do. So I was going kind of slow, but I still did it. Whoa, Luigi, that was amazing. I had no idea you could land sweet tricks like that. Listen, Tails, actually, you gotta tell you, Sonic's in a bit of a tight spot. The same goes for Mario and Toad. We came here to talk to you and figure out what we should do. What? Sonic's in trouble? And Mario and Toad, too? They're inside this game system. I can't believe it. How does this machine work? Whoa, wait a sec. This is... Going back in time. Chapter 4. The Secret Trick. The Olympic Games have only just begun. The next event will be ours, I tell you. Now we're serious. We're gonna win this air's uh, Olympic Games for sure. Mwahaha. Yes, that's the spirit. Let's start the next event before any of that passion cools off. The long jump is up, up next. Shall I leave this to you, Bowser? Also, in case anybody's interested, I do have a Discord server. If you're interested. Just what I was hoping you'd say. I'm ready to soar through the air. This one's a contest between me and Mario. Another chance to put him in his place. Okay, I'll be in the audi audience to support you. Uh, Bowser? Yo, what are you doing there? Practicing to take the dancing world by storm? Don't interrupt me. This is visualization training. Long jump. Alright. We'll earn the gold medal. Gold metal. Press A repeatedly to run to the foul line. The faster you press the button, the faster you run. When you get close to the foul line, hold B to start the jump. Keep B held down to adjust your jumping angle. Release B at your desired angle to jump. Alright. Let's do this. Mario, first jump. Oh no! I went too far. <laughs> he skidded. Okay. And the result is. Wow. That was at the wrong line. Final attempt. Wait, it's like I don't want to overshoot it. Seems a bit too steep. A tiny jump. Oh, too steep. Okay, so I don't want it to be that high. Mario on attempt number one. Taking it into high gear. Nope. It just told me. No. 
That was fail. Is that enough speed? The jump. No. Oh. oh. That jump didn't cover too much. You have to let go of it before jump. it doesn't come back. <laughs> Ooh, there. See? There we go. One. Okay. Next. I can't believe I lost. couldn't win this time, but there's more to come, Bowser. You mustn't give up. Off to find more gold medals. Eggman, what's the point of us even doing this? Ain't it more important for us to be finding a way back to the real world? Why, is that what you're concerned about? Shouldn't we be trying to find a way back to the real world? Wait, come again? It's about the gold! The gold medals! That's the key to returning to the real, real, real world. The only one and only way to get ourselves back to the real world is to collect gold medals. But you said we could never go back. That's exactly what you said. An utter fabrication. You think I'd ever give up some such crucial information to Mario and Sonic? I am a genius and I created this world, don't you remember? Naturally, I worked a few little tricks into its design. One of those tricks is if we can collect gold medals, we can return to the real world. Completely had me fooled, too. Mwahaha, and that's why we must gather up gold medals, no matter what it takes. It's gold or nothing. Gold, I tell you. We must gather up gold medals. I gotcha. Well then, I'm gonna compete in the Olympic Games and give it everything I've got. I'll make it rain gold medals. Uh... Mario, Sonic, I figured out what Eggman and Bowser are plotting. I heard them talking just now, and apparently there's a way to get out of this game. Knew it. The egghead was trying to trick us. Something smelled fishy from the start, so how do we get home? Apparently we need gold medals. Eggman said they had to gather them up. Huh, no kidding. And that's why he and Bowser suddenly got so interested in competing. We ought to just ask Eggman outright if we can really use gold medals to get back. They're still over there, I think. Toad, they're not gonna give you an answer. Hey, I hear there's a trick to get home, and if you- I didn't know better, I'd say you two lied. Don't look at me. I only heard about it five seconds ago. Take it up with Eggman. Huh? Where'd he go? Hey, now Bowser's gone. Where'd those two sneak off to? I think it's pretty obvious, Sonic. Oh, Penguin. Peep, peep. Oh, Pecky, you saw Eggman flying off to the west? Peep, peep. We found out about the trip to get home, so he hopped on a ride and took off, huh? Fine, I'll go after Eggman. Mario, you're taking care of Bowser, right? Solid, let's split up and chase down those two troublemakers.
Squeak, squeak. Hey Pucky, listen, I'm trying to catch Eggman. Looks like he left his Eggmobile and took off somewhere. Have you seen him around here? Squeak, squeak, squeak! You saw him get on a bullet train? Here comes the train. Squeak, squeak! So he's on that bullet train, huh? That's a lot of work just to lose me. Bullet train or me? Time to see who's faster. Okay, so we are racing a bullet train. It's nice to know. Get to Tokyo Station before the train does. Okay. Complete as fast as you can. Hold A as the game starts and release right at go. Uh, press repeatedly, B to jump. There are obstacles, hitting boulders or spikes slows you down. Bumpers will knock Sonic away. Make use of them to avoid obstacles. Uh, collect items by touching them. Passing through boosters will temporarily increase your speed. So this is like a Sonic level, which is cool. Game is over if Dr. Eggman's train beats you to the finish. Alright, I'm just gonna grab some water first. Hmm. Alright, let's go. station. There he is. Huh, that's strange. Where did Eggman go? Come on, Sonic. It's not Where's Waldo. Eggman's trying to be sneaky. Hoo hoo hoo! My plan to stall him worked! Time to take this chance and head to the next venue. Now play Bullet Train Blast in the game room. Sumida River. Alright, let's go find Eggman. <coughs> Mario, I figured out where to find Bowser. 
He's on a boat somewhere in the Sumida River. I think he's trying to get as far from you guys as he can. him by boat too, aren't you? Make sure you don't hit any other boats on the river. I'm gonna take a moment. I will be right back. Just give me a sec. All right, I'm back. Let's do this. Gotta chase a boat. Chase Bowser's boat and beat him to the goal. Okay, tilts to... oh. Monster Hunter updated. Okay. That was happening today. Anyway. Tilt up and down to move. Hold A to accelerate. B for turbo. Turbo is much faster, but using it will feel the heat gauge and uh, overheat the engine, causing you to slow down. Tilt back to raise the front of the boat. B to make the boat jump. Okay. Hitting cheap cheeps or other boats will slow you down. Performing a boat wheelie while hitting a wave will cause you to jump. Alright. Oh, Animal Crossing also updated. I wonder what that update is. Okay. If Bowser's boat reaches the boat, reaches the goal before you, the game is over. So it's pretty similar. So, there's no holding B, we just move and accelerate. Okay. Holding A, not B. You guys know what I meant. Alright, let's do this. Yeah. <laughs> 
that boost. Okay, well, there we go. Yep, come on. Oh shoot, no. Turbo. Oh shoot. That was... What? I... I beat it. That was really, really close. But okay. I'll take the win. You did it, Mario. I can't believe you caught up to Bowser. Your skills are a sight to behold. Yeah, even to me. I don't know how I did that. Bowser's got to know he can't escape from you now. With that kind of speed and skill, it's never gonna happen. Hey, I can hear you. Are you saying that specifically so I can hear it? Oh. That's what you think. You try chasing after me next time. Eek, Mario, what should I do? I made Bowser really mad. I might be forced to chase Bowser. I don't think I can catch him the way you did, Mario. Are you telling me to give it a try? No, no, I can't. We Sonic were here to help. Now that I think of it, I wonder how things are going for Sonic. I'm kind of worried. What is it, Mario? Huh, you're right. Bowser is gone. Mario, Eggman got away. How'd things go with you? Mario caught up with Bowser, but he slipped away and we weren't looking. What? Man, those guys really give us the runaround. They, they're probably meeting up somewhere right now. No, they're after the gold menus. You might be able to find them at one of the menus. Gold medals. I don't even know what I just said. <laughs> okay. You can now play the river boat ride in the game room. More trivia! When did Mario make his worldwide game debut? Okay. So this is tricky because technically 1980 five right but are we also counting his jump man years let's see 1981 we are okay Mario was first introduced in arcade game with 2d pixel graphics he was only 16 pixels tall and 16 pixels wide Okay, so you were including those years, but he wasn't actually Mario until 1985. Peep peep. Flicky says nothing is more refreshing than going for a jog along the river. It's a great treat to see Tokyo while traveling along its rivers by boat. On the Sumida River, there's a bridge that can do something amazing. It can open up at the middle, and the end of each piece rises up into the sky. That way, ships can go through. What's the name of this bridge? Uh, I've seen this bridge before because there's a bridge like this in my city, or, well, in our big city. Um,. It's not suspension, because that's that's the long bridge. And I don't remember the name. Oh, name of this bridge specifically, not the type of bridge. Okay. So well I wouldn't have guessed that anyway. 
Kachi Jokovic. It hasn't opened up since 1970 because now the big ships go a different way and little ships just go right under. Okay. I lost count of all the bridges spanning to meet a river. I love taking boats along the river. The wind feels great and it's the perfect little journey to refresh the mind. For many bridges, I think it would be fun to take a boat cruise and see the bridges from below. Okay. Wait, I don't think I talked to you. Mara, I had no idea you were such a boating expert. Please teach me sometime. Alright, let's go. Metropolitan Gym. So if you, that's where they are. Okay. Go. Bowser seems very excited about the gold medal. We're just going right into it, aren't we? Or we're going to the next chapter. The Lost Game System. So we're going back to the future. Okay. Whoa! It looks like Sonic and Mario are competing with Eggman and Bowser inside this game system. Huh? Competing? Come again? The system's called Tokyo 64, right? Oh, I get it. It's based on the Olympic Games, so they must be having fun with all kinds of events. It seems hard to believe that they'd be taking this situation that lightly. I can't really imagine why they'd be competing in the Olympic Games like that, though. Hey, you guys thought you could play games and keep it a secret from me? No one's allowed to have fun like that without me. I'll be taking this game, thank you very much. Wait, what? Dad's trapped inside it? What are you even talking about? Oh, I get it. They put him in there as a playable character. No way he'd okay that. It's rights infringement. He's gonna get Cuba Truth legal and bring the thunder. That's not it. Luigi's telling the truth. Mario, Sonic, and Eggman are all trapped, all trapped in there too. Huh? So the game's based on some past Olympic games? Guess that explains why the graphics look so blocky. Okay then, I'll go be a detective and figure out if you guys are trying to trick me. I'll go somewhere you can't bug me and look into it, so I'll be taking this with me. Well, this sure is a pickle. Ugh, he can't just go around taking the stuff from people. Let's hurry up and chase him. Yeah, we gotta find, find Bowser Jr. and get the system back. Maybe he ran off to another venue. Let's start by checking the sites closest to us. But I heard some places you need a pass to get into. First, let's go find ourselves some venue passes. In that case, what if we went looking for people who have passes? <laughs> Tails has joined. Tokyo 64 has been taken. Where did Bowser Jr. go? How about we go and try and find someone with, with the pass? Okay, so that's... Let's just go. Oh, 
Ah, they're at Tokyo Tower. I went up the famous Tokyo Tower. I didn't take the stairs, obviously. Elevator all the way for me. In Tokyo Tower, 250 meters up is a floor called the top deck, but it had a different name before 2018 when it was renovated. What was its old name? Um, well, it was an observation area, so... I don't know. Observation deck? <laughs> Special observatory. Okay. Close. So it's on the right path. This was the former name of the top deck when it opened in 1967. It's a great place to look out at the city, but in the past it was used as a storage space for operating the tower. So it wasn't always an observatory. Okay. Cool. Tokyo Tower's top deck used to be called the Special Observatory. He just gave me the answer. Okay. Mm. Tokyo Tower was completed in 1958, so it was already here during the Tokyo 1964 games. I'm not a big fan of heights. Okay, that's all they say. And I can't talk to these guys. Such a great view! Let's go again! Looks like they're having fun. Alright, let's talk to you then. Hi! Tails, Luigi, did you come old? Did you all come to Tokyo for a little sightseeing? No, we're actually here looking for Bowser Jr. We're pretty sure he went to one of the events. We don't have entry passes to get into the venues. Yeah. We're looking for passes. You should have asked me earlier. Yeah. I had passes for the Tokyo Aquatic Center and the only uh, urban sports park. Had? I climbed up Tokyo Tower earlier, and it seems that I dropped my passes somewhere. I don't have them anymore, sorry. If you happen to come across them, you're welcome to keep them. Really? I never break a promise. Alright then, Look, we'll find them for sure. Okay, so let's do this. Scale the tower. Oh, wow. When there is an elevator right there. <laughs> okay. To obtain the pass to the top before time runs, runs out. When gripping a hold, tilt to set direction of your next jump, then press A. While in midair, you can slightly control your trajectory. You can stay on blue holds for up to 9 seconds, yellow for 7, and red for 5. You have up to 15 seconds on rainbow color. Okay. So, we want to try blue, yellow, and rainbow. We don't want red. Springs are safe and launch you in a set direction, but watch out for bumpers. They can bounce you into spiked bolts or even cause you to fall off. Touching a spiked bolt or falling off will result in a penalty. You'll lose 15 seconds and start from the last checkpoint. Okay, let's do this. All the way up.
gonna wait for that thing to move. We have to beat. But I think I'm doing all right. Um. Oh, okay. No, I was supposed to go straight up. That was confusing. But we did it. That's the important part. Now we have the passes. Cool, you got the passes. So you don't mind if we take them, right? Ooh, swimming. Do as you like with them. Oh, so I'm coming with you. It sounds like things are pretty serious. Entry passes A and B required. Now play tower climb. Hi. All right. So let's find our next location. going to be over there. Swimming. And another sports park. Alright, let's do this. Okay. Looks like we're not going there. We're going to here. There's the sports park. Talk to everyone else first. This is the Omi Urban Sports Park. People sometimes confuse it with Ariaki, so be careful. I gave sport climbing a try, but I couldn't climb at all. My arms are just too short. I always wanted to try wall climbing. Like, I just think wall climbing is so cool. But I never ended up being able to do it. Yeah! Welcome to the Omi Urban Sports Park. This is the venue for sport climbing. Athletes will scale a wall using handhelds. What's the name of that sport? Well, I just called it wall climbing. Okay, sport climbing. Fine. We call it wall climbing. But okay. There are three disciplines. Lead climbing, bouldering, oh yeah, it's also called bouldering, that's, also, that's true. And speed climbing. Climbers are ranked on total scores from all three. But I've only ever heard it called wall climbing. This is an area of reclaimed land called Odeba. Odeba? What? You want the game back already? Come on, you can let me play with it a little longer, can't you? 
Hey, did you know Eggman, Mario, and Sonic all show up in this game too? And the competition's really heating up, so don't bother me, okay? Go away. Hmm. Well, well, the whole gang is here. This game is more popular than I thought. Bowser Jr. is really into it now, though. It looks like he won't be done with it for a while. You'll have to wait anyway, so why not take me on in an event here? <laughs> when we're done... Hello, the stack popper! How are you? Thank you for the follow. Um, you'll have your turn at the game. Sound like a win, right? Ugh, none of you ever stop talking. I'll give it back if I feel like it. I'll take Rouge on. I think, I think her name is Rouge. I'm good. Glad to hear you're good. Make sure you cheer me on, everybody. <laughs> Better watch yourself, princess. I don't hold back for anybody. Okay. Get this. I like her pants, though. And her shoes. L and R to grip the first hold. Climb the highest. Okay. Guard the hand icons. So it's similar to the past game, in a way. Before the time to leap leaves you off balance and depletes your gauge greatly. Star shaped super hold. Uh, super climb. You can leap and grab holds one after another by well timed presses. Okay, cool. We'll try. Daisy is going to destroy. Yep. I have faith in her. It's okay. I just took it a little slow. But it's alright. done. I didn't expect you to get the better of me in this event. I'm quite the athlete when I give him my all, you know. What? By the way, where's Bowser Jr.? Huh? He was here just a minute ago. 
We have to find him and get the game system back. Why don't you go and take a look at some other venues? He should still be nearby. Alright. Where did he go? Did he go swimming? Yep. He went swimming. The Tokyo Aquatic Center is nice and cool, but it's not open to the public during the Olympic Games. Can you think of the biggest crowds you've ever seen in your life? The crowds at the Olympic Games are probably even bigger. How many people do you think can watch the action? I want to say like 30,000. Okay, half of that. 15,000. I... It was a guess. <laughs> Once the Olympic Games are over, the venue will be changed to reduce the capacity of 5,000. Okay. So a lot of seats. Yep. Okay. Swimming is a popular event at the Olympic Games. If you don't hurry, the seats will be all filled up. Japan starts each new day before Europe and America do. Yep, cause time zones. This facility was built for the Tokyo 2020 games. No wonder the pool is all shiny and new. Before I talk to them. Gotta talk to everyone first. I was confident in my swimming skills, but I realized how wrong I was when I saw the competitive swimmers up close. Okay, that was it. Now we'll go talk to them. Looks like there's no trivia here, other than that one. You guys again, do you ever give up? Hey, where'd you guys get this game thingy from? Uh. Huh, where? Me and Prince Bowser Jr. were looking at it and we saw King Bowser and Eggman in it. Yikes. And they were competing in the Olympic Games with Mario and Sonic. Who in the world made this thing? It smells mighty fishy. Oh. Right? They've been chasing me non-stop, demanding I give the game back. It's seriously fishy. Wow. Hmm. Stop right there. I think it's about time for you to be handing that game back, yeah? yeah? Who cares about that? I was just asking a question. When you talk like that, it just makes me even more suspicious. Prince Bowser Jr., you can't give the game back to these people. If you want it back that bad, then take me on and win. Fine, I'll take you on then. I have zero tolerance for those who break their promises. I'm with him. I don't like people who break promises either. But, I mean, sometimes there's good reasons. Sometimes there's no excuses. So I guess it depends on the promise. <laughs> Defeat Wendy. Alright, hold R to charge power, tilt down at go. Move according to stroke style to swim. The faster you move, the quicker you swim. Keeping a good pace will fill the gauge, but swimming too fast will drain it. When it's 50% full, Press R to enter Super Swim. Quickly tilt for a hopeful speed boost. Okay. To so reach the end of your lane, hold R to charge the gauge. Tilt down to kick the wall to turn. Or as your character. Yes. Okay. Let's 
do this. Take your marks. Ready. Oh. oh, shoot. Let's try that again. All right. Um, start exactly at the go signal for a super start. If charge powers match, you'll surge forward. Okay, let's try that. swim and I made it. Victory's mine. Okay. I did it. Just barely. But it counts. I lost, but I was so sure I was the best swimmer. Oh, my poor wounded pride. Oh, yeah. You people are so cruel. I can't believe you do something like that, like this to such a delicate maiden like me. Or you think maybe you might be milking this one a little. No, no, no. All I did was win fair and square. You're acting like I'm some kind of villain. But, but I, ugh, I'm gonna cry. Gotcha. Yeah. Now, Prince, take the game to Eggman Nega and show it to him. What? She pulled one over on us. Yeah. Uh, duh. We're gonna have Eggman Negesh figure out what the deal is with that game. Until then, Prince Bowser Jr. is gonna keep it. Luigi, things could get messy if Eggman Nega gets his hands on that game. Let's go look for Eggman Nega too. You can now play as Wendy. Alright. Okay. Well, we're going to talk to everyone. So. Yeah, we just have to exit. What is that? We missed something. I thought we got them all. Okay, in 100 meter freestyle, all athletes are allowed to swim however they like, but they all choose the exact same way. Do you know what it is? Butterfly stroke? Front crawl. Okay, I'm not a swimmer, <laughs> for the record. I don't know how to swim. They will pick the front crawl because it's the fastest way 
What color are Wendy's high-heeled shoes? Uh, well, they're pink. She may be selfish, but Wendy is also exciting, fun, and very fashionable. As you can see. Yes, see, the answer is in the picture. That's not how trivia should be. But at least it's one that I could answer. <laughs> but I would have gotten it even if it wasn't. Because I know she wears pink. Okay. So, let's see, we have to go up there. The Budokan place. Oh, we didn't say anything new. Let's just talk to them. What? Oh no, we're too late. I thought this was nothing more than a toy, and yet this game is deeply intriguing. Oof. Some sort of video game in which Eggman and Bowser compete with Sonic and Mario. Whoever could have constructed it? This is a mystery worth investigating. Right? I want to know too. I think it's about time for you to give the game back. You played it enough, right? Well, I want you people quit. It's just a regular old game, isn't it? If you want it back so bad, then try and beat Eggman Nega in, in karate. I wanted to learn karate as a kid, but I never got to. Yeah, so it's just about to enter. Do you think you can defeat me? If so, by all means, let's, let us meet on the mat. <laughs> but should I merge victorious, I shall. I will keep the device for the time being. Still want to give it a try? Hey. We got this. Each hit you land will score a point. The first to ten wins. A to punch, X to kick, slower than punches but longer reach. When the super gauge is full, R to do a super strike. Alright. Let's beat him up. This shouldn't take long. <laughs> And we win. That took no time. didn't say how to take him down. We just had to take him down. <laughs> okay, hand the game over. Do as you wish with this thing, it's no concern of mine. You can't be serious! Hey, come on, you have to investigate that game. I brought it all the way here! Aha, uh -huh, I remember now. Ha, huh, yes, I see. What? What do you remember? <laughs> The concept for this game is something Eggman thought of long ago. Okay, and... 
In essence, this game system is unmistakably one of Eggman's creations. What? And Mario, Sonic, and Dad got sucked into it? I'm so sick of hearing that joke. Ugh. He told you, it's not a joke, it's the truth. Hey. If that's true, then we definitely cannot give back the device. I'll need to do some serious analysis and find a way to return Eggman and Bowser to the real world. Yeah, we gotta save Dad and Eggman. Let's get out of here, Eggman, nigga. Is he, like, supposed to be another version of Eggman? I don't even know, like, which game does he come from? Well, I'll hang on to this game system for the moment, then. Wait. This is a mess, just like I thought. If he gets a chance to analyze the game and free Bowser and Eggman... Sonic and Mario might end up trapped in there forever. Yeah, we gotta do something to get the game system back. Okay. Oh, this one's new. If you want to find someone, you should try act asking Vector. He said he was planning to compete in the discus throw. Okay, cool. Olympic Stadium. Ooh. This showed up. Karate will be included for the first time. There are two karate events. One is Kumite, but what is the other? I don't know karate enough. I mean, I'd say jitsu, but I'd probably be wrong. Kata. See? I don't know enough. In kata, uh, athletes don't fight each other. They display various karate techniques and are judged by their performances. That's cool. See, I was just questioning this question. So, I don't know the answer. A descendant, that's the reason. Okay. He inherited Dr. Eggman's scientific genius as well as his wicked sneakiness. He doesn't actually like Dr. Eggman. Okay. Why are they called, both called Eggman? I still think of it as Dr. Robotnik. I know it's Eggman now, and has been for a while. So if he wants to get Bowser and Eggman out of there, but then he doesn't actually like Eggman, that's interesting. Any more trivia over here? Because apparently they can just respawn. Okay, well. Next story bit, I guess. Luigi, there's Vector. Let's ask him to help us find Eggman Nigga and Bowser Jr. And I think we're going back in time. Another showdown. Yep, back here. Back to where we left off. That's the way, Bowser. With that meddlesome hedgehog and his pals gone, this is a walk in the park. We'll keep Mario and Sonic in the dark as we collect an armful of gold medals. Ho oh, ho ho, I was a bit panicked at first and we got sucked into the game. 
I'm a genius to program this hidden trick if I do say so myself. Don't you agree, browser? Are you trying to brag or do you want me to tell you how great you are? Both! Once you get out of here, I'll praise you till the Goombas come home. Very well, let's keep going and win a gold medal in the next event too. I shall demonstrate my genius. Eggman, Bowser, sorry to burst your bubble, but we know all about your scheme. You know, the one with the gold medals and the trick to get back to the real world. What are you talking about? I know nothing of it. I've never heard of any trick. I heard everything you said. You're both really loud. No, you sneaky little shroom. I know it all now. Guess this means it's not much of a sacred trick anymore. Fine, if the secret's out, then yes. If we gather up gold medals, we can return to the real world, and you're not stopping us. Now that we know how to get back, we're not sitting back and letting you do whatever you want. Ah, oh, you dare to take me on in this next event? How is Eggman gonna do gymnastics? <laughs> how does that even work? That event, my little blue and red friends, is the vault, a specialty of mine. Not even you can outdo me, Mario. Eggman, go get that gold medal. All right, let's let's do the vault. Press A repeatedly to run. When on the springboard, jump gauge will appear. Press A to vault. Enter the command shown to perform your vault. Okay. After entering commands, press A right as you land. A poorly timed landing will cause you to lose points. Hopefully you don't fail. Okay. We can choose our difficulty. But I'm not sure what that means for scoring. Well, let's start with easy. Mario. First jump. Great momentum. Oh, not high enough. Oh, shoot. Mess that up. Great momentum. Look at that. Beautiful. A nice landing. I've seen better days. That record beat the last one. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay. Let's try again. Let's try normal. Mario. First attempt. Great momentum. Look at that. Oh no. ah, shoot. A nice landing. I've seen better days. That wasn't great. We have one more chance. Great momentum. So high. What am I doing? I don't even. Okay, we are trying that again. Mario. You want to hit it while it's green, not when it's red. Great momentum. Look at that. Oh no, no. not fast enough. I've seen better days. 
That was awful. Second jump. Okay. I can do this. I just need to crap concentrate. Great momentum. Airborne. Oh no. No, it's I missed that. Landing. I've seen better days. Darn it. Record beat the last one. Let's go back to easy. Mario. First jump. Great momentum. The takeoff. Oh no. No, how do I miss landing. that? I've seen better days. On the second jump. Great momentum. Airborne. How will the landing be? Decent score. That Not enough. One. A new personal best. Okay, maybe it has to be on normal. I'm not sure. Mario. First jump. Great momentum. The takeoff. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no indeed. Number this two. shouldn't be that difficult. I mean, it's not difficult. Great but, you know. momentum. The takeoff. How will the landing be? Decent score. That record. Be five. Scored. I got five. <laughs> A new personal best. Just, just keep trying. have to do it as quick as possible. I'm not that quick. Great momentum. The takeoff. Oh no. no. A perfect landing. I missed the last one. Get this. I'm getting closer. First jump. Great momentum. Airborne. How will the landing be? Decent score. Not enough. Second Have to attempt. be even faster. Great 
momentum. The takeoff. How will the landing be? Not, not good enough. A new personal I'm event. just under. Trying. Mario on the first jump. Great momentum. Airborne. Oh, no. no. Fail. On the second. Okay, come jump. on. Second. Come on. You can do it, Mario. Great momentum. The takeoff. Oh, no, shoot. No. I've seen better days. Starting over. Hands are getting a little tired. That doesn't help. Mario. First jump. The takeoff. How will the landing be? Season score. On attempt number two. Come on, please. Great momentum. Airborne. How will the landing be? No. Nope. I've seen better days. Ugh. Well, I inched a little closer. I'm getting close to wanting to skip the event, but... Just gotta keep trying. Mario. First jump. Momentum. A strong jump. Oh no. Darn it. I've seen better days. Second jump. Yeah, Great my hands are getting tired. Airborne. Which doesn't make it How will the landing be? easy. Record beat the last one. But it's not enough. <sighs> okay. I'll try going for hard. <sighs> Just to see what it's like. Mario. On the first jump. Momentum. The takeoff. Oh, no. oh, that's what it's like. Okay. I've seen better days. Throws in directional Second keys. Attempt. Great momentum. Airborne. Oh, oh. no. Yeah, let's go back to normal. My hands are getting quite unhappy with me. Mario. <sighs> First attempt. It's not too bad, it's just great momentum. Airborne. It doesn't How help things. On the second jump. Great momentum. Airborne. How will the landing be? No, 
not enough. That record beat the last one. Gosh, this is annoying. Eggman. Mario. Why? On attempt number one. Great momentum. The takeoff. How will the landing be? Oh, that was that's my highest so far. Second Not enough. Time. But hopefully this will be it. Great momentum. Airborne. Oh, no. No, a bot landing. I messed up. A I just messed that landing. up. My hand <sighs> is giving me issues now. I'm gonna give it one more try, and if I can't get it, I'm just gonna have Mario. to skip because I'm running out of time. On the first jump. Great momentum. The takeoff. How will the landing be? I've seen better days. On the second jump. Great momentum. The takeoff. How will the landing be? Darn it. I've seen better days. I'm sorry. <laughs> I really wanted to get it. Should we skip? I feel like I should give it one more try. Even though my hand is hurting. <laughs> okay. One last try. up my directions. Second attempt. Like I shouldn't be doing that. Great momentum. Airborne. And oh, I did it no. again. That was that was embarrassing. Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna let this beat me. We're gonna try again. Mario. First jump. Great momentum. Airborne. How will the landing be? Ugh, not enough. On attempt number two. Great momentum. Airborne. How will the landing be? Season score. It has bested me. My hand is done. I. I can't keep trying. I'm sorry. I really, really wanted to beat it. But I can't, because then it will just hurt. You nailed it, Mario! Not really, I cheated. 
I just skipped. Nobody can top us. Let's keep this win streak going. Ugh, those meddlers. Eggman, don't you have some kind of trick to stop them? You made this world, right? I didn't program any tricks like that. Keep your shell on, Bowser. After all, they don't know what to do once they actually get the gold medals. Wait, just getting the gold medals isn't enough? Why didn't I realize that? Wahaha. Okay. Start of chapter 7. Time for analysis. Luigi, there's Vector. Let's ask him to help us find Eggman Nega and Bowser Jr. Back here. Luigi, Tails, what hap what's happening, guys? You here to give the discus throw a shot? <laughs> Better warn you, though. I'm about to enter myself, so there's no chance of winning. Whoa. I don't think this one will be too bad. Hey, hold up. That sounds pretty serious. You gotta get that game system back pronto. Exactly, which is why we'd like you to help us look for Eggman Negan Bowser Jr. That's gonna take come down to one thing, my fee. Oh. That or take me on and discus throw and win. Fair enough. If you'll help us if we win, then we all just have to win. Let's get to throwing. Okay, we're gonna do this. That'll be the last tilt to take your stance and get ready. Rotate clockwise to charge the power gauge. Power gauge is hidden during competition, so learn how power is charged during practice. Try to angle the controller 35 degrees, then press X to throw. Okay. This is mostly using my other hand, so it'll be fine. Too much power will result in a foul. The power gauge is above 90% and thrown close to a 35 degree angle, your throw will become a super throw. Okay. This is a motion control. Alright. 35 degrees. I think I can do that. Oh, thanks for the follow, Alum. Two attempts total. Okay. Remember what you practice when you throw. Nope, that was, that was not right. Okay. Let's try that again. Okay. We didn't actually... get my angle right. Start. 
29 degrees. Okay. A little more up. Ooh, perfect! Sweet. Look at that. Look at that. That was good. And that was not good. How did that not count? I'm confused. I can't believe I lost you, Tails, but you're really something else. Well, I promise, so I'll help you find Eggman Nega. Let's do it. Hey. I'm a pro at this stuff, so we'll have him sniffed out in no time flat. <laughs> Great, thanks, Vector. Hmm. When you're looking for someone, you want to have lots of help gathering info. Check it out, there's Toadette over there. Let's get her to help out too. <laughs> okay, well, as much as I would love to keep going and grab Toadette, let's just do these next two trivias, and then we gotta, I gotta get going. For the discus throw, the athlete spins around and around inside a throwing circle before letting go. How wide across is the throwing circle? Um. Six feet is typically your arm span, if you're tall, I guess. Or maybe, yeah. Eight feet, I want to say. Two and a half meters. I don't know the meters to feet, so. I, I can't calculate that in my head. <laughs> the spinning is a modern practice. In the ancient Olympic Games, they didn't spin at all. They just stood on a big block and threw with a scooping much potion. What is Vector's favorite thing? Uh, his necklace? Money! Okay. Oh, gold. If there's money involved, there's no job too shady. However, since he also can't help- s can't stop helping the poor, he's always broke. Well, that's a good reason to be broke, I guess, because at least he's helping. Like, he's a good guy. Not that it's good to be poor, but you know what I meant. <laughs> um, okay, so we are going to stop there. Let's go to menu. Um, we're gonna have to quit. I guess it's automatically saved, right? I guess. It must be. 
anyway, thank you for hanging out, and let's see who's streaming right now before we go. Maybe we can read. Let's just check. And also, you want me to continue this game, or should we just go and do another island and go vacation, or maybe both if there's time? At this point, I mean, I'm doing this series as a lead up to Pokemon Snap. Now, I'm not gonna get it when it comes out, unfortunately. So, I'm not exactly sure when it will actually arrive. Because, uh, Amazon's not being super helpful <laughs> on that front. So, at this point, I have no idea when it shows up. So, yeah. I was thinking of maybe going back to go vacation, but I can totally do this again if that's wanted. So, just let me know. Um, okay. Well, we're just gonna go say hi to Shatur again, because I don't see anyone else. Okay, that's fine. No problems there. Alright, so thanks for hanging out, and I will see you next time. Just gonna switch. There we go. And let's get this raid started. Thanks again for hanging out and I hope you join the raid. Bye for now.